Shalom. Welcome to Cold Search. All right, folks, I've got a great location to do a reading with you. You know, Hanukkah is on its way. It's not very far from now. And uh, I thought I'd read uh, from Maccabees. There are four books, and um, there's a reason behind that. Some people believe that uh, Hanukkah and the menorah, uh, and the story is that they ran out of oil, and, uh, and so it goes. It, the oil lasted eight days, um, but I want to show you something different. And uh, according to the Book of Maccabees, so we're going to read from the Sefer. But what, before we do that, I want to read what Wikipedia has on Maccabees, just to give you kind of an idea of what's going on here. And by the way, the word Hanukkah means dedication. So um, this was going on and around the time of Antiochus Epiphanes, if you recall from the Book of Daniel. Um, when it talks about the abomination of desolation. And then, in the book of Matthew, uh, chapter 24, uh, Yeshua talks about uh, when you see the abomination of desolation. And then it has, in parentheses, um, let the reader uh, understand. And this is because this has already taken place. So, we're going to be talking about that particular time in history, which is uh, before... Uh, Yeshua some almost 200 years or so but uh, this is what, what uh, Wikipedia has uh, in the second century BCE Judea lay between the Ptolemaic uh, kingdom based in Egypt and the Seleucid Empire based in Syria kingdoms formed after the death of Alexander the Great in 356 to 323 BCE Judea had been under the uh, Ptolemaic rule but fell to the Seleucids around 200 BCE. Judea at that time had been affected by the Hellenization begun by Alexander. Um, there were some changes made there in the temple. Some Jews, mainly those of urban upper class, notably the Tobiah family, uh, wished to dispense uh, with the Jewish law and to adopt the Greek lifestyle, according to the historian Victor Tekarover. The main motive for the Tobiads, Hellenism, was economical and political. The Hellenization of these Jews built a, uh, they built a gymnasium in Jerusalem and competed in the International Greek Games with the Olympics, how, uh, apparently. Uh, they removed their marks of circumcision and uh, reputated by the Holy, Holy Covenant. Reputated by the Holy Covenant. When Antiochus Epiphanes from 20, uh, excuse me, 215 to 164 BCE, became ruler of the Seleucid Empire in 175 BCE. The high priest in Jerusalem was Onias III. Uh, to Antiochus, the high priest was merely a local governor within his realm, who could be appointed or dismissed at will. While to Orthodox Jews, he was divinely appointed. Jason, the brother of Onias, bribed Antiochus into making him high priest instead. Jason abolished the traditional theocracy and constituted Jerusalem as a Greek polis. Uh, Menelaus then bribed Antiochus and was high priest uh, in place of Jason. Menelaus had Onias assassinated and Menelaus' brother uh, Lysimachus stole holy vessels from the temple causing riots and that led to his death. Menelaus, Menelaus was arrested for Onias' murder and was and was arranged before Antiochus. Arraigned before Antiochus, but he bribed his way out of trouble. Jason sub subsequently drove out Menelaus and became high priest again. Antiochus pillaged the temple and attacked Jerusalem and led captive uh, the women and children. From this point onwards, Antiochus pursued a zealous Hellenization uh, policy in the Seleucid Sapatry of Co uh, Coel, Syria, and Phoenicia. The author of the first book of Mac Maccabees regarded the Maccabean revolt as a rising of the pious Jews against the Seleucid king uh, who had tried to eradicate their children against the Jews who supported him. The author of the second book of Maccabees presented in the conflict as a struggle between Judaism and Hellenism words uh, that he was first to use 
Most modern scholars argue that the king was re reacting to a civil war between the traditionalist Jews in the countryside and the Hellenized Jews in Jerusalem. Uh, though the king's response of persecuting the religious traditionalists was unusual in antiquity, it was immediate provo provocation for the revolt. According to Joseph P. Schultz, a modern scholar, uh, scholar he says, considers the Maccabean revolt uh, less, than, less as an uprising against foreign oppression than as a civil war between the, uh, the Orthodox and reformist parties in, Jewish, in the Jewish camp. While John J. Collins writes that while the civil war between the Jewish leaders led the, to the king's new policy, and it was wrong to see that the revolt was as simple as a conflict between the Hellenism and Judaism, since the revolt was not provoked by the introduction of Greek customs, typified by the building of the gymnasium, uh, by, but by uh, the persecution of the people who observed Torah, and by having their children circumcised and refusing to eat pork. Uh, in the conflict over the office of high priest traditionalists, the Hebrew and Aramaic names like Onias contested with the Hellenizers with the Greek names like Jason and Menelaus. Uh, the authors point out to social and economic factors in the conflict uh, uh, where it began as a civil war took on the character of the invasion when the Hellenistic kingdom of Syria sided with the Hellenizing Jews against the traditionalists. As the conflict escalated, Antiochus prohibited the practice and the practices of the traditionalists, thereby in a departure from usual unusual excuse me, from usual solicited practice, banning the religion of an entire people. The, the scholars argue while the rising began as a religious rebellion, it was gradually transformed into a war of national liberation. According to Maccabees uh, Book 1, Antiochus made the, the possession of Torah a capital offense and burned the copies he could find. He banned many traditional Jews and Samarian Samaritans, religious practice, r ritual sacrifice, and uh, Sabbaths were forbidden. The feasts were banned and circumc circumcision was outlawed. And mothers who circumcised their babies were killed along with their families. Altars to the Greek gods were set up and animals prohibited to Jews were sacrificed on them. Uh, the idol of the Olympian Zeus was placed in the altar of the temple and this, however, represented an exaggerated view of Antioch's support for the Hellenization uh, within Judea. And by the way, this is where the abomination of desolation took place. He sacrificed a pig on the altar, but also put up an image of Zeus in the temple. Uh, and then we get to the revolt. In the narrative of 1 Maccabees, after Antiochus issues his decrees forbidding Jewish religious practice, a rural Jewish priest from Modin, uh, Matthias the Hasmonean, sparked the revolt against the Seleucid Empire by refusing to worship the Greek gods. Uh, Methanias killed a Hellenist Jew who stepped forward to offer a sacrifice to an idol uh, in Methanias' place. He and his five sons fled to the wilderness of Judea. After Methanias' death, about one year later in 166 BCE, his son Judas Maccabee led an army of Jewish dissidents, uh, dissidents to victory over the uh, Seleucid dynasty in a guerrilla warfare which at first was directed against the Hellenizing Jews, of whom there were many. The Maccabees destroyed pagan altars in the villages and circumcised boys and forced Jews into outlawry. The term Maccabee is used to describe the Jewish ar army has taken from the Hebrew word hammer. The revolt involved many battles in which the Maccabean forces gained notoriety among the solicit army for their use of guerrilla tactics. After the victory, the Maccabees entered Jerusalem in triumph and ritually cleansed the temple, reestablishing the traditional Jewish worship and installing Jonathan Maccabee as the high priest. A large uh, solicit army was sent to quash the revolt, but returned to Syria on the death of Antiochus and his commander Lysias. Uh, Lysias. 
preoccupied in, in internal solicit affairs, agreed to the political compromise that restored religious freedom. So what they did was uh, they, cleansed, they cleansed the temple and restored things as they were um, and actually prevailed. So there was a dedication that took place. The Jewish festival of Hanukkah celebrates the rededication of the temple following Judas, uh, Judah Maccabee's victory over the solicit. According to rabbinic tradition, uh, the victorious Maccabees could only uh, find a small jug of oil that remained uncontaminated by virtue of a seal. And although it contained enough oil to sustain the menorah for one day, it miraculously, miraculously lasted for eight days and by which uh, time further oil could be procured. And by the way, this is where the story comes. And the reason why uh, it had to last for eight days is that was the time it took to process oil from uh, when it was taken from the tree and it was actually crushed and made into uh, an oil that could be used. It took uh, eight days to do this. So, uh, the Maccabean rule. Following the rededication of the temple, the supporters of the Maccabeans, uh, excuse me, Maccabees were dividing over the question of whether to continue fighting or not. When the revolt began under the leadership of Mathanias, it was seen as a war for religious freedom to the end of the oppression of the solicit. However, the Maccabees realized how successful they had been and they wanted to continue the revolt and conquer other lands with Jewish populations or to convert their peoples. This policy exasperated and divided between the Pharisees and the Sadducees under later Hasmonean uh, monarchs such as Alexander, Alexander Janaeus. Those who sought the continuation of the war were led by Judah Maccabee. On his death in the battle at, in 160 BCE, Judah was succeeded in, as his army commander by a younger brother, Jonathan, who was already high priest. Jonathan made treaties in with various foreign states, causing further dissent between those who were merely desired religious freedom and those who sought a greater power. In 142 BCE, Jonathan was assassinated by uh, Diotius Tryphon, a pretender to the Seleucid throne, and was succeeded by Simon Maccabee, the, the last remaining son of Mathanias. Simon gave support to Demetrius II Nicator, the Seleucid king, and in return to Demetrius, uh, accepted the Maccabean from tribute. Si Simon conquered the port of Joppa, where the Gentile population were forcibly removed, and the fortress of Gezer was expelled from the garrison and the Arca in Jerusalem in 140 B BCE. He was recognized as uh, by the assembly of the priests and leaders and the elders as high priest, military commander and ruler of Israel. Their decree became the basis of the Hasmonean kingdom. Shortly after, the Roman Senate renewed its alliance with the Hasmonean kingdom and commanded its allies in the eastern Mediterranean to also do so. Although the Maccabee won autonomy, the region remained a province of the Seleucid Empire and Simon was required to provide troops to Antiochus, uh, Cities, the brother of Demetrius II. When Simon refused to give up the territory he, that he had conquered, Antiochus took them by force. Simon was murdered in 134 BCE by his son-in-law, Ptolemy, and was succeeded as a high priest and king by his son, uh, John Hyrcanus I, Antiochus conquered in the entire district of Judea, but refrained from attacking the temple or uh, interfering with Jewish observance. Judea was freed from the solicited rule on the death of Antiochus in 129 BCE. Independent Hasmonean rule lasted until 63 BCE when the Roman general Pompeius uh, intervened in Hasmonean civil war and made it a client kingdom of Rome. The Hasmonean dynasty ended in 37 BCE when uh, I do mean Herod the Great became king of Israel. Uh, Herod I believe was a uh, a Greek Jew if it were um, designated king of Jews by the Roman Senate. Effectively um, the story of Maccabees is told in Maccabees 1 and 2 Maccabees which are uh, Deuteronomical books in some Christian biblical canons. And third 
and 4th Maccabees, which are in a few Eastern Christian canons. 1st and 2nd Maccabees are part of the Catholic and Eastern Orthodox canons, but not part of the Protestant Old Testament or the Jewish Bible. The name Maccabee is often used as a synonym for the entire Hasmonean dynasty, but Maccabees uh, proper were Judah Maccabee and his four brothers. The name Maccabee was a personal effort of Judah and later generations not as direct descendants. One explanation of the name's origins that derives from the Aramaic Maccabah, the hammer, in recognition of Judah's ferocity in battle. Traditional Jewish explanation of, is that Maccabee is an acronym for the Torah verse, which is the battle cry of the Maccabees, which is Ma, uh, excuse me, Ma Komoka Beloim Yahuwah, which is Who is like you among the heavenly powers, Hashem, as well as the acronym for Matinahu Kohen ben Yochanan for correlating the Torah verse Exodus 15:11, uh, the songs of the children of Israel by the sea. Uh, makes reference to Elim, which is a mundane notion of natural forces, heavenly might in war, in governmental powers. This scholar and poet uh, Aaron Kaminka argues the name of the corruption of uh, the Maccabini as leading commando in the army of King David, uh, the holy Maccabean martyrs. Two Maccabees and four Maccabees recount the martyrdom of seven Jewish brothers. And I believe this is where the menorah represents the seven lights um, in, in, in these brothers. Their mother and their teacher, although they are not said to be of the Maccabean family, they are referred to Christianity as the holy Maccabean martyrs or the holy Maccabees. According to one tradition, their individual names are Habim, Antonim, Geriah, Eleazar, Yusbon, Hadim, Halim, uh, or Halim, Marcellus, and the mother Salomonia, and their teacher Eleazar. And the three Ethiopian books of uh, Maccabean, uh, quite distinct works of other four books of Maccabees which are canonical in the Orthodox, uh, Ethiopian Orthodox Church also refers to the Maccabee martyrs. The first of these books states that their father was a Benjamite named Maccabeus and that there three and that they and that three of the brothers who are called Abaya, Sela, and Fentos who captured and martyred for leading a guerrilla war against Antiochus Epiphanes. The first day of these saints is the 1st of August in both the Eastern Orthodox Church and the 1st of August is also the first day of the Demetrian fast in the Catholic Church. Uh, from the time of the tri Tridentine calendar, the Holy Maccabees had uh, a commemoration uh, in the Roman Rite liturgy within the Feast of St. Peter in Chains. This commemoration remained with the weekday liturgy when uh, in 1960 Pope John suppressed this uh, particular Feast of St. Peter. Nine years later, uh, August became the Feast of St. Aldophos, Alphos, Alphonsos Maria de Ligiogori in the mention of the Maccabee martyrs and was omitted from the general Roman calendar uh, since it was since 1969, and revision is no longer admitted in the uh, commemorations. And that is what Wikipedia has on the Maccabees. And we'll continue with uh, some of the chapters from the four books in another video. Shalom and may Yahuwah bless you.